This is my DJI Phantom 4 Pro version 2 and I started getting a scary error when I was flying it for work yesterday. Here's the error from the screenshot of my phone. You can see it says rear left vision sensor error A00040. There's two errors with the same number. I just didn't know if these would let me take off, if there was any reason they could crash the drone, so I needed to do something about it. And I also got an error when I fly my grid software. So this is Leechy, the phone app that I use to fly in a grid pattern, and you can see it also says that there's a vision sensor error. It still lets me take off, but I needed to get this fixed for insurance purposes. I was worried that I was going to have to send my drone back with all the expense and downtime that that involves, and I just couldn't do it. So I took a chance and called DJI, and the support gentleman helped me fix this myself. So I'm just going to show you how to do it so you don't have to send your drone back or find out that it's disabled for a little while. You just open DJI Go 4, go to the Settings tab all the way to the top, to the main controller settings. Scroll down to the bottom and under advanced settings, scroll down a little to sensors. Under that section, there's the calibrate IMU. You just take off the propellers, leave it running. And it says, put it on flat ground, calibrated as shown and keep the aircraft powered on. When you hit start, it gives you instructions. The word instructions are not nearly as important as the picture instructions. So you just keep tipping the aircraft to the orientation that the instructions show you. So in this case, you've got the camera facing at you and you're supposed to set the drone onto its landing gear and its rotors. And now it has to tip you the opposite direction This one is setting it on its nose with the camera down. And then this one is turning it completely around so the battery is down. The last one is completely upside down, which is why it's nice if you have the propellers off. And that's it. It says restart, but I guess that restarts the app, not the drone. So you still have to manually reboot the drone. And then when it comes back up, the error that I showed you before is gone. It's still obviously upset because we're indoors and it can't get the GPS lock, but the IMU and sensor error went away. So I hope that helps. Thanks for watching.